Welcome to Comfort Avenue number two. I'm your host, Echo Fan Grey Wolf. So, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to explain two songs to you, The Price You Pay For Loyalty, and Bleed For Me, right now. Alright, so, The Price You Pay For Loyalty, and man, it's a fact. If you're loyal to anybody, and they don't appreciate you, that's the price you are paying for being loyal. And you pay a big price to be loyal. And I don't have a problem being loyal. I just want you to be loyal right the fuck back, you know. If I'm going to bleed for you, you need to bleed for me. And I know that's two different songs, but that's just a fact. The price you play with loyalty is that sometimes you just may have to bleed for that person that you are loyal to. The question is, will they bleed for you? No. And the whole point of the price you pay for loyalty is what led me to the song Bleed. So I was walking from... um these places that I was looking for today. So there's two studios here in Charlottesville. And one is the Lighthouse. They don't have a phone number, so I have to Google them. And the other one is the Charlottesville Media Center. I have to call them to make an appointment. So we will be doing that on Thursday when I get off from work. Because I work tomorrow. But when I get off from work, I will get up tomorrow writing my book. God damn it. I will get up Thursday and writing my book. And then I will contact them to see what we can work out. And see how much it costs to see if I can get everything I've ever filmed, edited, and done. You know? And see if they'll give me like a really, really decent price and how much time it's going to take. And will they edit it overnight and make sure that my shit doesn't get stolen again. So that way that the Guardians of the Earth can be done. Path of Ascension can be done. And maybe better. And then um, everything else. Clone Affair, if I still can find the footage. Um, everything I've ever really done movie-wise, which is like... Clone Affair, Path of Ascension, Guardians of the Earth, The Cleanup. Those are all the movies that I've done that you've never seen and never heard. Alright? So if I can get all that shit done, oh yeah, and my Spider-Man fan film where I'm Ben Riley and the bad guy. That was That's going to be probably the hardest, but it's probably going to be like maybe 30 minutes at best when it's all put together. Anyway, I'm going to see what they're doing. So that's the whole concept of that. Now, back to the story. I got, I was walking home, and you guys seen the prototype, if you watched every video before this video, then you seen the prototype song of The Price You Pay For Loyalty. Granted, I butchered every one of those remakes. Every one of them sucks, and I'm sorry, I, in the middle of the song, you can tell I lost it. I lost everything I was going to say. I completely lost it. And then I got to the third song, and lost it again. So, The Price You Pay For Loyalty is, um, not really good songs. I'm sorry. I made up for them. With all three of the bleeds. I like Bleed. I hope you guys like it too. Please share it. I never ask you to share any songs. But those three songs you can probably share. Just like White Line Fever. You can share those. Because that was one that I had Jan Michael Vincent on my brain as Longfellow Hawk for um, Airwolf. I do not know if Jan Michael Vincent is actually a native. So I'm not going to invest too much into finding that. Because he's, he's passed and God rest his soul. But he played a native on TV. So... As a person who is mixed native and black and white, um, that's how that happened. But anyway, for bleed, I mean, I got to thinking, because sometimes the price you pay for loyalty, you will bleed. Which is what led to the song of bleed. So hopefully, you guys will like bleed. You might not like the price you pay for loyalty, and I won't be mad if you don't, because I don't like them. So... Yeah, it is what it is, but I am still going to post them. Even if I don't like them, I'm still going to post them. So, um, it is what it is. But Bleed is probably, like, the best. Now, the longest one is the third one. And that thing's almost five minutes long because I didn't know how to end it. And that does happen sometimes. I don't know if other singers go through this shit because I'm an actor, not a singer. I don't know how to end songs properly, which is also what fucked up The Price You Pay For Love. I don't know when I should have stopped. So, yeah, that got fucked up. But anyway, for Bleed, like the last one, I put both of the, the courses together and just kept going and kept going and kept going because I didn't know how to fucking stop. I didn't know where I should have stopped. So, yeah, ah, that's that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the songs. I am okay. I am fine. I am perfectly fine. I am in a great place right now, except for the lighting in this room. Really fucking sucks for some reason. But I'm in a great place. Bleed is not, like, bad. 
but you know the the very first song was about me taking my oath to service so becoming a military person and a lot of vets probably can relate to that because when you take that oath of service basically they want us to bleed for them especially if you're fucking infantry so now you know and then um i did mention my crush without mentioning my crush so um i gave her interest signal when she gets into the wrestling ring and she does this so if you see any wrestler that does that you know who she is and everybody who's been following me y'all already know who it is it's the flawlessly beautiful and dangerously sexy zeta zang so yeah there's that now in closing of this you know um i think that if we all understand loyalty and the people we are willing to bleed for you know because you're willing to bleed for family and you're willing to be for friends that are family, then that will be that. So thank you guys very much. I'm your host, Echo Fan Grey Wolf. This is Comfort Number 2. Be seeing you.